Yes guys, welcome back to another episode of When Men Stop Simping for Women. As always, let's get straight into it. You're playing checkers, he's playing chess. You think he's trying to make a good impression with you? He's trying to get with your mum. He knows you're gonna come straight back. He's probably making you dinner. He'll probably come down, sit there, like act like nothing's happened, get angry again, then he'll smash. Next day, you'll feel good again. My favorite game. Let's cut it open and see what's inside. It could be chocolate. It could be meat. It could be apples. It could be a Ford F-150. Let's take a look. <laughs> oh, it's rice. I don't get this obsession of having to post your partner on Facebook or Instagram or any of this shit. How does that prove your love for someone that you're posting them on, their, on your social media? This shit is toxic as fuck. This reminds me of that song, anything you can do, I can do better. It's like, if you're gonna insult me for how long I've lasted, then I can get just as toxic as you. Don't start shit that you can't finish. Women can literally be saying to their friends that they fucking hate you. And in that night, you'll come over there, smash them good, and all will be forgiven. And then the friends will see you there at a little birthday meal and they'll be thinking, what the fuck? I just heard this guy's a massive scumbag. He's a piece of shit. Hey, just throw it at me. Just throw it, just throw it at, just throw it at me. I'm gonna catch it. Just throw it at me. I'm gonna catch it. Stop. Just throw it at me. I'm gonna catch it. All the women will call you a little boy to wind you up. So then when you do go, you're really trying to prove something and you give it to them good. You don't think old women don't know that younger guys don't try to satisfy them harder. Still beat though. 